With April 7th by-elections looming large, it's shaping up into a two-way race. In the capital, former Minister of SMEs Park yong sun from the ruling party against former Seoul Mayor Oh se -hun, selected as the unified candidate of the main opposition bloc. Yi kyung has the latest. There's now a clearer picture of the upcoming Seoul mayoral by-election. The opposition bloc on Tuesday announced their unified candidate as the main opposition People Power Party's Oh se -hun, who defeated his rival An chol -su of the minor opposition People's Party in public opinion survey. Now the former Seoul mayor is aiming to clinch the position again a decade after he resigned following a low turnout in a referendum on free school lunches. For the past 10 years, I have been living with a heavy heart, with a huge burden on my chest. Now, as I try to gradually lift off that weight, I call on your support so that I can offer you a city that runs again. The Liberal bloc has already unified their candidacy with the ruling Democratic Party's Park yong -san. The former startup and SME's minister won a primary with Kim jin -hye of the minor Open Democratic Party. Park on Tuesday also called for the public support as the party launched a special election task force. Young adults are among those hit hardest by the impact of COVID-19, as well as small business owners. Seoul City will step up to provide them with jobs and homes and provide protection and support. The two candidates will start their official campaigns on Thursday, and the election will be held on April 7th. On the same day, there will also be a by-election in the city of Busan. It will see a race between Kim Young-chun of the ruling DP and People Power Party's Park Hyung-jun. Both cities are holding by-elections due to sexual harassment cases linked to their former mayors, both from the ruling party. The winners will serve the remaining term of the previous mayors, which is a little over a year. These by-elections are being held one year before the presidential election, raising the stakes as the outcomes could potentially set the tone for the presidential race. Yang Eun, Arirang News.